The world of technology and artificial intelligence is an area that is ever changing. Since the advent of the first computers, people have dreamed of a way to create a computer system which is a perfect simulation of the human brain or even beyond. Humans are shocked by the winning of AlphaGo because scientists predicted AI will not beat humans until at least 10 years later. However, Professor Michael Tiersha from School of Computer Science and Engineering, UNSU Australia, said, "Through AlphaGo wins. It does not mean AI beats humans." AlphaGo has been programmed to play Go, and this is all it can.、Uh, so、uh, it is unable to do anything else besides what it has been programmed for.、Um, it's now better, it seems, than any human player, but it still only is good at Go. And this is probably the biggest weakness of many existing AI systems that they lack what we call artificial general intelligence. Actually, Google itself is a big believer in AI. In recent times, its self-driving cars have been gaining a lot of attention. Besides AlphaGo, Professor Michael Tiersha says the sporting world is also an area that has seen the growth of technology and AI. The Robot Soccer World Cup, or RoboCup, is an international robotics competition founded in 1997. It aims to have a team of fully autonomous humanoid robot soccer players win a soccer game complying with the official rules of FIFA against the winner of the most recent World Cup by 2050. However, the growth of AI can put humans at risk. Robots can displace humans in some particular tasks because they can do a lot better. That's the reason more and more robots are entering our daily life.、Uh, I think so. Yeah,、uh, I think an intelligent agent is often a lot better than a person at doing a particular task. So they can be useful for doing. Whatever task you need that they're designed to do, maybe not to do everything that you do, but、um, at one spe- specific task, they're often a lot better than a human. Professor Michael Tiersha believes that artificial intelligence is not a threat to society, but surely will affect the job market in the near future.、Uh, it's probably going to affect. Um, us all in the near future, I suppose that、um, many of what is considered to be white-collar jobs might soon be replaced by uh, computers um, that have that degree of artificial intelligence that suffices to replace some of these jobs. So I'm pretty sure that the job market as a whole is going to change in the near future, precisely because of that. And again, think of self-driving cars or self-driving trucks,、um, and many other、uh, jobs that a computer might be able to do just as well as humans can do, if not better.